This is Lake Jiangcheng, northwest of Shanghai, a place that Chinese foodies flock to every year to get their hands on mitten crab. They're prized by Chinese chefs all over the world because they have this wonderfully intense, rich flavor that's much sweeter than ordinary crab meat. I'm keen to try them and cook them for the first time, but I won't have to travel nearly 6,000 miles to do it. Mitten crabs are one of the most expensive and sought after delicacies in China. But what very few people know is that they're available here in the River Thames. Mitten crabs in their millions are taken over the Thames. They hitched a ride on slow boats from China in the 30s. And with few natural predators, their population has exploded. It's somewhat hard to believe that we're on the Thames and they say there's the most amazing delicacy sat right underneath us now. I'm going to cook mitten crabs in an authentic Chinese way. So to get my hands on some, I'm meeting fisherman Dave Pierce. How are you, sir? You all right? Excellent. Dave lays eel nets on the Thames, and at this time of year, they're often full of mitten crabs. So you're fishing for eels, but you don't even want the crabs. No, so they just, they're just coming up. One eel, what we want, and a load of stuff you want. Is that an average size? That's a good one. I mean, that's a big mouth. I mean, we measure them across there, yeah. but that is as big as they get. Really. That's incredible. I mean, they're quite oh. a ferocious looking thing, aren't they? Aren't they? What someone said to me, if you put them on their back and they can get back up, they're quite good condition. So you try them on his back, and obviously you see he's got back up, so he's a good one. Because Dave is licensed to lay nets on the Thames, we can keep these crabs as a bycatch. That, my son, is a very good catch. To clean away any river nasties, the crabs will be rinsed for two days under cold running water. The bucket's full of delicacies. Everything, yeah. Hey. We can open a Chinese restaurant afloat, can't we? <laughs> we'll get a barge and we have one out here.